Hey, Clyde, you gonna see Samurai Cop 2? This movie's gonna be awesome. I I'm taking this date I have. We're going all the way to Los Angeles. You have to see this movie. It's gonna be awesome. It's not gonna be as much fun as with my asshole roommate. Oh, fuck, he's here. He's got the camera on me. I gotta go, Clyde. Bye. Hi. So, we all know it's October. And this year, I'm doing so an episode that might be controversial to some, but it really shouldn't be. It's the Dukes of Hazard episode, The Hazard of Horror, which aired on the CBS network on November 7th, 1980. This is a funny episode. This is an episode you can watch with the kids and you can all have fun with. The episode's about this woman named Mary Lou. She buys this mansion. And these silver thieves are in there doing, you know, hiding out, and they're trying to scare her away. And, of course, Bubba and Luke, being the gentlemen that they are, they go into, you know, in there, and they're helping her out get the place ready. And, you know, they hear these noises. They're looking, you know, to help her out find, it, you know, what's going on. And, of course, they think Boss Hog has somehow a connection to it. But it's not. These guys are actually going after to steal Boss Hog Silver, too. So, it's, they're messing with both people. And they try to drive Mary Lou insane at one point. And, of course, Daisy's there and helps her out. And it's just obviously just a funny episode. I mean, it's an episode you can put the kids in front and you can all just have a lot of fun. You don't have to worry about, you know, them really getting scared. You know, the Dukes, they end up helping her out and saving Boss Hog's gold. And, I mean, it's just really a lot of fun. I mean, I know I'm just sitting here saying it's a lot of fun, but it is. I mean, if you've ever watched The Dukes of Hazard, it's a funny show. I mean... I really don't know what more to say. It's, it's just a lot of fun, and I really hope you check it out this Halloween, you know, with your kids or if you're single like me. So I would really appreciate, you know, check it out. And so until then, trust me, I know what I'm reviewing.